I'd say Streaks is probably one, but I feel like these two have gone pretty close in terms of sets. Like they've both won and, and lost about the same amount. Place higher. Yeah, I think this could be like a decider set for for their placement. So they're about to get into it. I gotta go ahead and change the layout. I know. Alright, <clears throat> so apparently, I mean, I, I don't know so much about it, but BWC and Lucretia have both told me that they think this matchup is actually kind of hard for Kirby. It's pretty bad for Kirby. I don't know, uh, I can kind of see it because Kirby just generally isn't a very good character, but like, he has a pretty decent dash shield. He has good mobility. Uh, see you, Omega. See you, dude. Omega's left the building. But yeah, I, I agree. Yeah. I think he's like people. Have, people have been in like bottom five, and bottom ten. I definitely don't agree with that. I don't think he's good, but I don't. I think he is a bit slept on. I don't know. He has really nice frame data and mobility, but that's not mattering to Lucretia right now. He's yet to get a hit. Good anti air using the up air to deal with uh, the Kirby dare. Kirby dare is like one of his win conditions. I feel like if you get hit by a Kirby dare, then you're in for a world of hurt. So if you can avoid the Kirby dare, then you're usually pretty good. A timely air dodge from BWC. Damn, BWC just cannot get in right now. The problem is, I guess, I guess the problem in, is in this matchup is that like Kirby's uh, approach is incredibly linear, so it's not hard to just even if you don't have like gyro or laser on board, you can just kind of like plan around it. Yeah, you just be like, well, he's running at me in a straight line, because that's all he can do, right? So I'll figure out a way around that. Ah, uh, unfortunate. I like the uh, the dash attack that looked pretty punishable, and then just the instant turnaround aggressive option from Lucrecio. Back air from BWC. Run up spot dodge. Okay, I mean, definitely could have grabbed him there. Safe up air and shield. Oh wow, wastes out the air dodge and hits him with an up smash. This is a rough looking game right now from PwC. I don't know if maybe he change if he if he loses this game one pretty hard. I mean, I, I can't imagine Zard versus Rob being much fun either, so... I don't know. Yeah, I'll probably stay and look for a better, better stage, I think. I think Smashville could be a bit better for him. Ah, uh, and the gyro kind of protected him there. Yeah, he couldn't, he couldn't like... He wasn't. He wouldn't have been able to like punish that standard get up with an up smash because the gyro would have hit him. That's unfortunate, but that's just the way the uh, cookie crumbles. So heading into game two, very fitting for the finale of of Lucretia's Lit Fest, the finale of Mario Kart. So they're going back to Battlefield. I don't know how I feel about that, but maybe BWC just feels like his play wasn't on point that game, and he can just play a bit better game too. Because previously, for a long time, BWC was one of Lucretio's demons. Like, Lucretio couldn't beat BWC. Was, there's like four or five people he's truly scared of in bracket, and BWC was one of them. Good, bear out shield. Jab block, ooh, nice, there, grab. Ooh, fair! Look at that damage, dude! That was like uh, 20 to like 70 real quick. That was really nice. Oh, careful. Rob there is AIDS. Don't forget. Is he gonna go for an edge guard? He's just kind of hovering to put the fear in him. <laughs> yeah. You should have seen it. He did it pretty nice early. He bounced it off the balloon on Smashville oh, and picked yeah, yeah. up. That was kind of cool. <laughs> oh no, that's a really bad edge from BWC. He's alive, but like that was scary. Dare? Oh, dare, jab, jab, grab. 
I like the mix-ups here from BWC. Also, fun fact, I don't know if you've seen the Izzor's video about Kirby, but what BWC just did there is he actually um, did an instant back air out of the uh, back throw to actually reduce the end lag of back, air, uh, back throw. I can't remember exactly how it works, but basically, in buffering back air out of back throw is faster than just waiting for the uh, back throw animation to end. It's really interesting Kirby tech. Kirby's a really interesting character. I like Kirby. Gets the weak hit of F-Smash. Yeah, this is the final set, so we're all going after this set. Alright, BWC in the lead here now. Just playing mad patient. Oh yeah, I like that. He just, uh, see you guys. Uh, just waiting for an, uh, an approach from, from Lucrecio. Mm, got him in the platform. Ooh, there it's a grab. Got him before he slipped off the platform. But yeah, BWC's play is definitely a lot. So far. Yeah. That's what I love about these like kind of weird characters you don't see a lot. Like you get to see a lot of creative stuff that you've never seen before. It's variety, you know. It's a shame that UK will play with like fucking dry characters. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'd love to see a down B from BWC at some point in this set. Like a good down B. <laughs> Not uh, you know, like I'm playing my friend at a party who's never played Smash before and he's picked and he's picked Kirby. You know what the fuck he's doing, don't you? Like <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Remember told you about the time that I was at a house party and uh, they had Smash there. Oh wow, uh, unfortunate SD from PWC. I challenged everyone at the party to, to beat me in Smash, but I was playing Wario and I was only allowed to use bite, bike or grab. And, and the agreement I made was that if I beat all of them, then they all have to take a shot. But if any of them beat me, I've got to take three. And I, I got down to the last guy and he fucking beat me. And I was so salty. Like, I know it was a party and it was for fun. I was low-key a little bit salty. I was like, for fuck's sake, like, I beat everyone else. <laughs> but yeah, BWC just kind of got this game well in hand. As long as he doesn't let anything silly happen to him. Yeah. I feel like he didn't want to go... Didn't want to go any deeper because he already expended quite a lot of jumps going for that initial dare. Also, talk about the herb box shift underneath that laser. What's he looking for? Oh no, no, don't do it to him. Oh, okay, back air there from BWC. Nicely done. Good to see you game three in our final set of the day. One one between BWC and Lucrecio. We need more guys like BWC in Smash UK. People who play cool characters. That's high key. That's why. That's why Meltdown doesn't get the viewership we want, right? Because like, look at France. In in the top echelons, they have Wario, Greninja, Charizard, Roy, Falco, Captain Falcon, and we have like a Samus who comes to our monthlies. <laughs> All right. Okay. Oh, he was looking for it. <laughs> he wanted that that Lucrecio side. That's not even a robber side, man. That's a Lucrecio side. Down throw to Abby. Really, a trap remix of Super Mario 64. That's what that's what we've gotten to now, is it? Yeah, it's kind of slapped. <laughs> I like the empty-hop down tilt there from BWC. Just uh, empty hopping the bait out of spot dodge and then just kind of pokes away at him with his little, little foot. Is it a foot or is it a shoe? Like, are those his bare feet? Ooh, gets the up B spike. Is he going to gimp him? Yes! Is he going to run out of fuel? Yes, he is. That was a beautiful gimp from BWC. Very nicely done. Very nice. Let's see if Lucretio can put that best disadvantage state in the UK into good use. And claw his way back into this match. Looking like Harry Houdini, that gyro actually just disappeared in his hand. That was so weird. Why did that happen? <laughs> Punishing the errant swallow with a, an up smash. My man BWC has been learning from uh, from Mia Khalifa or something. The amount of swallowing he's going for. Up throw. Up there. Pelly next to me, too young to understand the joke. What an innocent soul. Huh? <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> Jump, <laughs> jump, air dodge. <laughs> jump, jump, pair dodge. Yeah, again, BWC just kind of got this game well in hand. He's, he's just got to continue to play safe like he has. 
I'm not sure what adjustment he's kind of said to himself in his head that he's going to make between game one and two, but it's clearly been a pretty big one. I like the safe pokes. Rob doesn't really have any good way of like retaliating to pressure beneath him when he's on the platform. He just kind of has to jump away. It's not like you could like shield drop up there like you were Cloud or something. Yeah, fair. And he's at 91, man. Like he is actually in kill percent to a few of Kirby's options. 104. He's about to get two stocks. Is he about to get two stocks? Oh, what's he looking for with the gyro? Oh, okay, that would have been cheeky. Killing the man with the gyro as well. I feel like an up throw on that top platform is going to kill now. Lucretio needs to not stall on that platform because he's going to get trump bared for it as a 2 1 to BWC. And that is the final game of the day. Well done to BWC, taking it over Lucretio. So there we go, that's all the games for today. Uh, I'm going to let TPL get on the mic and go through the scores.